Welcome to our Rolling Strong Video Library, a series designed to help you maintain a better life on the road. Hello, I'm Christy Coughlin, Wellness Coach with Rolling Strong. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, share it with others, subscribe to the Rolling Strong YouTube channel, and click on the bell for notifications. Summer is the best time of year. Barbecues with family and friends, time at the beach and pool, wearing flip-flops, growing flowers, and the abundant sunshine. While we all crave the sun, the harmful rays can do lasting skin damage and are proven to cause skin cancer. Skin cancer is the number one cancer in the U.S. according to the Skin Cancer Foundation. One in five Americans will develop skin cancer by the age of 70. Since the 1970s, malignant melanomas, the most dangerous type of skin cancer, have increased 4% every year. Approximately 9,500 people are diagnosed with skin cancer every day, and two people die every hour from the disease. As few as five sunburns in your lifetime doubles your risk for melanoma. It's important to understand the damage the sun causes, your risk factors, how to protect yourself, and the importance of early cancer detection. There is no such thing as a healthy tan. A tan is a sign of skin damage, as is a sunburn. Sun damage and exposure is cumulative, so the more sun over your lifetime, the greater your risk. Tanning beds also contribute to skin cancer. Acute and long-term effects of a tan and sunburn include degenerative changes in the skin like freckles and pigmented areas, accelerated aging of the skin like wrinkles and loss of elasticity, excessive dry skin, increased risk for skin cancer, including basal, squamous, and melanoma. There are two types of rays emitted from the sun, UVA and UVB. UVA rays are long wave and can reach the middle layer of your skin. UVA are also emitted from tanning beds. UVB rays are short wave and associated with aging and burning on the outermost layer of skin. Both types of rays do damage to skin cells that can lead to skin cancer and premature aging. UV rays continue to cause damage even on cloudy days. 80% of the damaging rays still come through the clouds and can penetrate glass. Drivers should take precaution from these damaging rays every single day. Those with fair skin are more at risk, but darker skinned individuals can still suffer from skin damage and skin cancer. Your risk is higher if you have fair skin, blue eyes, red or fair hair, live in a southern climate, suffered sunburns as a child, have a large number of moles, have a history of benign skin cancers, or if you take medication that increases your sensitivity to the sun. Basal cell carcinomas and squamous cell carcinomas are abnormal, uncontrolled growths that arise on the outermost layer of the skin. Basal cell is the most common form of skin cancer. These benign forms of cancer can metastasize or spread if not detected and treated early. They appear mostly on the face, neck, hands, scalp, and ear, places regularly exposed to the sun. They are almost always curable when discovered early. Self checks and regular physician skin checks are important for early detection and treatment. Melanoma is the malignant form of skin cancer. It develops in the cells that give the skin color or melanin. Melanoma may appear as moles and can be found all over the body, even in places not exposed to the sun. Melanoma can be treated if detected early, but its ability to spread quickly can make it very dangerous. Early detection has demonstrated that 99% of skin cancers are curable. The key is monthly skin checks on your own and at least once yearly physician checks. Check out how to perform a skin self exam from the American Academy of Dermatological Association. Take the time each day to protect yourself from the damaging rays of the sun, even on days you plan to remain mostly indoors or driving. Apply a broad spectrum sunscreen to protect from both the UVA and UVB rays every day. Find sunscreens that you like and you don't mind putting on, then you'll use it. 
Use SPF 15 or higher and apply 30 minutes prior to going outside. Use SPF 30 or higher for longer outdoor exposures. Apply a heaping shot glass, about two tablespoons of sunscreen to your body. Reapply every two hours or after swimming or sweating. Pay attention to your ears, neck, hands, feet, lips, and head when applying sunscreen. Limit your time in the sun, especially during prime sun time between 10 and four. Utilize an umbrella with SPF when at the beach or park. Wear protective clothing, including long sleeved, a wide brimmed hat and sunglasses. Use caution around snow, sand and water that reflect the damaging rays. Keep babies under the age of six months out of the sun and protect your older kids from the damaging rays of the sun. Enjoy this summer, but stay safe in the sun. This is Christy Coughlin, Wellness Coach with Rolling Strong. Look to more Rolling Strong videos providing insights and tips dedicated to a healthier life on the road.